Hey, this is John Carlos, and I'm here with a look at the 2018 Emerald City Comic Con exclusive Funko Pop of Amy Pond that I got at Hot Topic. Well, even though the, the feet are a little wobbly, it still stands pretty good on that, that right foot. But I definitely think it needs the assistance of the figure stand it comes with. As long as Funko's been making Doctor Who Pops, I've wanted them to make an Amy Pop. I mean, they did Rose, they did Clara, but we haven't had Amy, one of the most enduring companions of the New Who era. And I'm glad they finally did it. Um, they went with, uh, you know, her initial, like from the uh, the 11th hour, her, her Kissagram outfit, which is iconic. I mean, even just for that one episode. Here, I'll kind of do the little exorcist spin so you can see the back side of it there. Um, but I'm surprised they didn't go with, you know, some of her more like standard outfits. But still, considering that Rory was such a specific one too, with Centurion Rory, I guess it's fun that they're going with this specific one here. The wrinkling of her skirt is good, the handcuffs are well painted, uh, little tiny details on the, the sculpting of her shoes and shoelaces, so that's nice. I like the pose with the hands on the hips, and uh, you can make out the words police on the little vest there. You can see the blue and white checkering on the vest. So some nice detail, the checkered tie turned out really good. Um, there's a little glop of black paint going onto the checkering on the left, but that's not too bad. The uh, the belt buckle on the skirt and the wrinkling on the skirt's really good. Tiny little body, but a lot of good details in it. Uh, the hair is really uh, well done on this too. I love the way the hair kind of falls and swoops. It's a really, really good sculpt. Um, I think the eyeballs and eyelashes and the eyebrows look pretty good. I think they went a little overboard with the freckles on her nose. I don't really consider her that freckly, but still, it works. Uh, the one that I have here has a little bit of glue coming out of the, uh, the edge for her hair there. A little bit of nick paint on the eyebrow. Not a big deal. Um, of the three I saw at Hot Topic, uh, the other two had better faces, but the bodies were covered in like factory powder schmutz, like like layers and layers of it, so much so that this black outfit read gray. So if you see this in stores, and if you have the opportunity to compare, be on the lookout for that. But I, I, I'm just grateful I was able to get one. So yeah, I think this Amy Pop looks great. That's my review, everybody. It looks great. Thanks for watching. And if you want, you can follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and all that stuff. <laughs>